going on? Screaming Eagles, Jet Eagle 101 here. Welcome back to The Walking Dead Season 1. In our last video, after Mark was getting shot and everything, we went, Danny and I went to the woods to try to find the bandits that shot them. But we didn't find them, but we found a crazy woman who was saying some crazy things. Saying she knows Danny and what they do on that farm. Got me a little skeptical. So when we got back to the farm, Kenny and I decided to look around in the back of the barn to see if we can find anything. But dinner was called in, and we only got a quick glance. And as soon as we saw it, we saw blood and butcher tools and everything. It was like, ooh. And so we're headed for dinner, so we're going to get self-washed up. So let's continue. So here we are. This chord is interesting. Hmm. Oh boy. Follow the chord. This chord is very suspicious. Ticket, I ain't gonna get it, so something's not right. Is that blood? Why was this door behind a bookshelf? Something's in it, something's not right. made you a meal. Yeah, Lee, what's gotten into you? He just had a start. He could use some goddamn manners. You're eating human meat. That's crazy. What the hell? That's ridiculous. Oh, I'm scaring the kids, Lee. Lee, what the hell is wrong with you? Don't indulge him, Lily. There's always something with this guy. Mom, I was eating that. We need to get the kids, everyone out of here. We need to go now! Mm -hmm. Yeah, we gotta Everything get out of here. could have turned out okay for you folks. He would have died anyway. We gotta think about living! Settle down, honey. Growing up in rural Georgia, you're taught not to waste. It's how I was raised and how I raised my boys. Now, you got monsters roaming around that do nothing but eat people. And for what? To continue to rot till they eat some more. We think we can put that meat to better use. Sick. Sick in the head. Lee, that's not a very nice thing to imply. Andy Animals. is right. We go after folks who were gonna die anyways, one way or another. Like y'all. Kenny, get your gun! Kenny, no! Nobody's going anywhere! We got lots of use for y'all right here. The fucking black Put your fuck. guns down! We're walking you out of here! Near my fucking Mommy, family! I don't want to die. Mommy, what did I eat? Somebody do something! 
Just Open great. the goddamn door! You can't keep us in here! <coughs> Open up! I will tear you fuckers Stop apart with my bare hand! We gotta find another way out of here! <coughs> you damn <coughs> fucking bastards! Mm -hmm. Open this door, goddammit! I will knock the we goddamn door stop. down! It, it was a person. They tried to make us eat a person. But you didn't do it. No. The rest of us did, goddammit! If you hadn't dragged your feet... Come on, Dad. Now's not the time. What happened? The man hit you. They threw us in the meat locker. Lee, we gotta get out of here. If they so much as touch my family, I'll kill those sons of bitches! Get us out, you sons of bitches! Dad! I'm scared. Don't be. It's gonna be okay. I'm gonna find us a way out of here. Dad, Don't give up. We're gonna find a way out of here. Can I help? Sure, honey. You keep your eyes open for exposed screws or loose panels. Anything we can pry away to open a passage out of here. Okay. Please settle down. Well, I'll rip your goddamn heads off and make you swallow. Don't want to know what kind. Come on, try us out. Shelves are pretty sturdy. We can climb up. But there's no way out through the ceiling. There's more of us on the way. Let us out now, if you want to live. That is not going to help. Could there be a hole behind these pallets? No such luck. They're not hmm. going to open the door. You, you think a fucking apocalypse gives you the right... Come on, Larry. Do you really want to attract their attention? Yeah, I want to attract their attention. So I can fucking kill him! Guess your new girlfriend wasn't all she was cracked up to be. What the hell is your problem? You were a prick back at the motor lodge, even after I saved your fucking life. And you went out of your way to be an asshole to me tonight. You must really hate me. But guess what? You're stuck with me. I plan to be around long after you're gone. And if you turn, I'll be the one to put the axe through your skull. No, you're not worth the energy to hate. Don't forget, I know who you really are. Dad, this isn't helping! Salt ranks. Bastards. Pretty heavy. Think we could heave it through the door? Nah, door's too solid. I'll, I'll break that damn door down! Dad, you can't get- uh, uh, Easy! Uh, uh-oh. Heart attack. No. Dad, come on! Dad! Oh, God. He stopped breathing. I think he's had a heart attack. Shit. Is he dead? He's not dead! Somebody help me! Fuck. If he's dead... He's not dead! You know what has to happen, Lee. Think about it. You saw that poor bastard at the motel? Mm -hmm. How fast he turned? What are you saying? Billy, I'm sorry. I truly, truly am. But in a few minutes, we're going to be stuck in a locked room with a six foot four, three hundred pound, seriously pissed off dead guy. Fuck you! We can bring him back, Lee. We'll mourn him later, but right now we have to keep him from coming back. No! God damn it, Kenny! He's not dead. Maybe you're right. No! Oh. God damn it! My dad survived worse than this! Look, Kenny, back at the drugstore when we all thought Duck was bitten. I gave him the benefit of the doubt. Maybe we should do the same now. That was different. Duck wasn't bitten. But come on! We know this guy's not gonna make it. Mm -hmm. Remember what Ben said. Gotta destroy the brain. Come on, Lee. You can't be in the middle on this one. 
You gotta have my back this time. God damn it, Lee! I need you! Please help me! Come on, Dad. Come on. Wake up. Wake up! I ain't taking no chances. I'm helping Kenny. You're right, Kenny. Let's get this you over. You fucking monsters! Both of you! I don't want to see. I'm sorry, Lily. No, no, no! That's the only way. <laughs> get off me! Don't do this! No! No, no, no! Let go of me! No! Please! Dude, no! Kenny! Oof. Oof. Sorry. We God couldn't risk us. it. We cannot risk it. I'm sorry. I Don't know. you fucking touch me! <laughs> Clementine. Clem. You okay? Why, Lee? Lily said he wasn't dead. I'm sorry. We couldn't take that chance. You understand why we had to do this, Clementine. So we won't turn into one of those monsters? Mm hmm. That's right. <laughs> it's okay. I know. I know. But you gotta be strong right now. I need you to be strong. Think about something else. Something hopeful. Like what? Someplace safe where no monsters can get you. We're gonna get out, right? Mm hmm You found a way out? I'm working on it. You, uh... You think maybe we were too hasty? Only one important thing right now. Getting the fuck out of here. We did what we had to. It's just you and me. Lily's in no condition to help us rescue your family. Considering what just happened, she probably sided with the St. John's against us. Katja and Doc. What about him? You don't think the St. John's... No! They, they need Katja, remember? She's the whole reason they brought us here. Mm -hmm. Sure. And Duck is valuable as a bargaining chip. We gotta get to them. And what was the other thing to talk about? What now? You got any ideas? The air conditioner. There might be a duck behind it. Oh, God. What are they doing to Katya and Duck? Ooh. There ought to be an air duct behind this unit. Maybe big enough for one of us to fit through. I don't know, Lee. Seems like a long shot. Does the air conditioner come off? I think I could take it off if I had something to remove the screws. The multi-tool. Of course they took it. Shit. Maybe there's something else we could use. I've got a rock. Ah, a rock won't help. But a coin might do the trick. Do you have a coin? Uh-uh. -uh. Not coming off that way. No, well, we need a coin. Lily, I'm, I'm sorry. Don't talk to me, Lee. Don't fucking talk to me. You've got to pull yourself together, Lily. Why? For your sake? So you can feel better about... about what you did? For your own sake. Right because you fucking care so much about me. I think I may have found a way out of here, but I need something to remove the screws on the air conditioner. Mm -hmm. If you had something I could use as a screwdriver, a coin or something. No. What about him? Look, I know this is a terrible time for it, but uh, back at the motor inn, Larry, Larry mentioned something about keeping coins in his pockets. In other words, my father's more useful to you dead than alive. If he was alive and had the key to getting us out of here, do you think he'd keep it to himself? What do you want? My blessing to loot his corpse? Your permission. <sighs> do what you have to do. Thanks. I don't really want to. This is not a good time, especially after oh boy. we just had to ice his... Any this idea guy. which pocket he keeps his change in? 
fucking vulture. I'm sorry, Lily. We had to. We couldn't risk it. I couldn't risk this. I gotta think about Clementine. Here we go. Two quarters and a dime. Oh, well, there we go. Problem solved. Just gotta remove these screws and get this unit off. You got it? Yeah. One more should do it. Probably lead right into that back room. It's too small for us to fit through. I can do it. Can you do it, Clementine? Can you do it for us? You uh, think you can do this? I'm scared. It's okay to be scared. We need you, Clementine. <sighs> okay. Mm -hmm. You got this, Clementine. You're gonna be fine. What do I do when I get out? See if you can get to the other side of that door and open it. Lee. Didn't even get to say goodbye. Get in here. I got an idea. Stay here. Take care of Lily, okay? I will. Yeah. Keep an eye on Lily. She she ain't right right now. Forget about Lily right now. What are we gonna do about this guy at the front of the bar? Well, I got a taser with me, so. Ugh. Ooh. Hey, watch your step. That's slippery. Mm hmm. So, what's the plan? That dumbass is so caught up in his own rant that we could probably sneak right up on him. Just stick behind me in case anything goes down. When we get to the front, grab his gun. Sounds good. Okay, you ready? Yeah, let's go. Stay close. Yeah, I got my taser, so... Or cattle prong. As it's called. Oh, there's the gun. We gotta get it, we gotta get it. Finishing that damn dinner first. Come on, get a plate of this. There. 
What are you doing outside the bar? Oh shit! Just guarding the place, like you said. Well, who's sitting out in the rain like a damn deer? Mama says we can't keep that many folks alive and not expect trouble. Take one to keep and kill the rest. Not that which one to keep Not to kill. There's enough meat on that tray. Oh, I know, Mabel. This is my favorite part, too. When I let one think they can just walk right out, <laughs> they never even look down. I'll keep an eye on him. We'll be ready to act when I say. See what he's doing now. Okay. Lee. Sick fucker thinks this is a game. See where he is at. Do I really want to? can live. Mm -mm. Cannibalism is not the answer. Aren't the walkers eating enough of us? You gotta keep me alive. If you kill me, the meat gets tainted. You can't eat it. You're already tainted. You ain't gonna kill me. Just like you didn't kill Jolene. You don't have what it takes. This is not how the world works now. You won't make me kill you. Fuck you, Lee. You and Kenny murder my dad, but you leave this piece of shit alive? Fucking bastard. Hey, I have to do what's right. He, he ain't bitten. Oh god, oh, don't hurt him! That's Katja! Uh -uh. Please, no! Lily, please, keep her safe. Something was up. What can we do? Larry's dead. They chopped off Mark's legs and tried to feed them to us. Shit. Is everyone else okay? They've still got Doc and Katja in the house. And I don't know where the fuck Kenny is. All right. We're coming in to help. The main gate is too dangerous. Go around the fence and see if there's a back way in. I'll keep looking for Kenny. Do you have a weapon? I don't leave home without it. Mm. Ben, stick close. And Lee, be careful. I left Danny in the bar. He got what he deserved. Come here. Let me go! 
Come on, don't do this. Please get back! Don't come in here! You just had to go snooping around, didn't you? Let her go, Brenda! Please! Please don't you take another step! Brenda, come on now, you know you don't want to do this! Just go away and leave us be! Come on, Brenda. Think about what you do. It doesn't have to end like this. I'll kill her, Lee. Just let me go. Come on. Don't be like this. Stay back! Don't do anything stupid! Let her go, Brenda. Please, listen to him. I'll do it! Please. Come on, Brenda. Don't do this. Do not do this. I don't want to kill you, Lee! Please don't make this any worse! Just stop! on yourself. No, uh-uh. You did this. All we wanted was a little gas to keep ourselves safe. Good job. Away from me, Lee! Get back! 
back here and finish this thing! I'm walking away from this. I did my part. Get back here and fight me like a man, Lee! Lee! Hey, Lee. I'd say I'm sorry for leaving the motel unattended, but, you know. I'm glad you showed up when you did. Mm -hmm. If you hadn't taken that shot at Andy, we might not have gotten out of there. Were they really killing people? For food? Yeah, they were. That is sick. God, just... Ugh. Clementine, she doesn't know, right? She's not stupid, Carly. Katya managed to grab this while she was in the house. She said it was with your stuff. Yeah. I found it while I was looking for the people who shot Mark. Do you want it? Why don't you keep it? Sometimes it helps to have something you can document your thoughts on. <sighs> How are you doing? I'll be fine. I'm just not as young as I used to be. Hun, go on ahead and give me and Lee a second. There's gonna be fallout. Mm-hmm. For killing Lily's dad? Yeah, I would imagine so. Yep. What do you think? I'm with you, Kenny. We'll do what has to be done. You're damn right. Listen, that RV back at the motor inn is just about ready. I've changed my mind. I want you to come with us when we leave. Yeah? Hell yeah. We're a team, man, me and you. By taking out Larry before he turned, you saved all of us in that meat locker. And that saved my family, too. Yeah, I'd say you earned it. <laughs> Thanks, Kenny. Come on, Clementine. Stay close. Lee, are those bad people dead? We didn't kill them, so I don't know. They might have been able to get away from the walkers. But I'm sure they won't be coming after us. That's good. Hey, Dad. What's that noise? Sounds like a car. Oh, God. Not more strangers. I hope not. I can't handle any more strangers right now. Don't shoot! We're here to help! <laughs> Figures. Oh, crap! Baby, you gotta see this. There's a shitload of food and supplies back here. This food could save all of us. Not all of us. <sighs> Look, 
We don't know if these people are dead. If they come back, then we're just monsters who came out of the woods and ruined their lives. This stuff isn't ours. Mm -hmm. Dad, whose car is it? Don't worry about that, Duck. It's ours now. It's abandoned, Ducky. Don't worry. What if it's not? Well, what if it's not abandoned? What if it is someone's? You're right. We shouldn't take this. What? Did you get some meal back there the rest of us missed out on? We have to take this stuff. We've done enough damage already. You mean by that? Come on, Kenny. Between this and the meat locker, you know what it means. Fine. Suit yourself. The rest of us are taking this stuff. Okay. What have we got in here? Look, there's more food in that box. They have antibiotics. What else do they have? See if there's any water. Here. Hmm. Got it? Yeah, I got it. Lee, there's a hoodie in here. Could probably fit Clementine. She's good. Thanks. Whatever, man. It's gonna get cold out eventually. Hey, there were some batteries in one of those boxes. I thought they might work in your camcorder. Here, you can have some too. For your walkie-talkie. Batteries, huh? Think you can handle those? You're not gonna let me live that down, are you? Nope. Never. Oh, God. Lee, you're gonna wanna see this. Hmm. Shit. Someone was recording us. Hmm. Nothing left. We gotta get the hell out of here. Lee, I need you to back me up on this. Is this all you got? I told you this town is tapped. Do you have any idea what we had to do to get all that? We need to leave. Duck was asking about the farm last night. Not much phase is It's starting to add up. I need to get to the coast. Get him out of all this madness. <laughs> Lily's not doing so good, huh? Well, we killed her dad. We did kill her dad. Mm -hmm. Maybe people out there got things lined up better. Better than us, at least. Could be folks who have all this shit figured out. Do people get mad when they're scared? Sometimes, yeah, they do. This is crazy! I'm the one keeping this group going! We can sort this all out, all right? We can sort this out. I'll tell you what we need to sort out. We can't let one person fuck this up for everyone else! Long road ahead. And that's going to be on our next video. Chop Dan's leg off, 44% of people, shot Jolene, helped kill Larry, 49 did, killed both St. John's, didn't kill both brothers, and we didn't steal. Alright, that's how it is. So, and this is where we're going to end it from here.
So, yep, this is where we're going to end it from here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit that like button. If you got something to say about it, hit it down in the comment section. Want to be part of the Screaming Eagles for more exclusive content? Hit that subscribe button and hit the bell notification for more upcoming videos by Jet Eagle 101. Have a good one.